On Tuesday, Americans stood in line that stretched around schools and churches in numbers this nation had never seen. It didn't matter who they were or where they came from, and what they looked like or what party they belonged to. They came out and cast their ballot because they believed that in this country, our destiny is not written for us, but by us. We should all take pride in the fact that we once again displayed for the world the power of our democracy and reaffirmed the great American ideal that this is a nation where anything is possible. This week, I spoke with President Bush, who graciously offered his full support and assistance in this period of transition. Michelle and I look forward to meeting with him and the First Lady on Monday to begin that process. It speaks to a fundamental recognition that here in America, we can compete vigorously in elections and challenge each other's ideas, yet come together in service of a common purpose once the voting is done. And that is particularly important at the moment when we face the most serious challenges of our lifetime. Yesterday, we woke up to more